Go down just a little more. Just like that. <laughs> I like it. Hot dog, look at that, it's working. <laughs> That's awesome. Disarm, slide, disarm, slide these up, put this in. There we go, crimpy, 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 and crimpy. There we go. That's how it'll connect onto the top.
three, five, four. Let's hang this thing. Okay. Very, very carefully. Don't knock and get some over. You don't want to knock things over. Pull these out. Flip it over. Slide down on these. Just like that. Very carefully. Just like that. Now, we'll pull the slack out of this. Okay, so let's see what we can learn here. Okay, so those will constrain it that way, but nothing is really constraining it going that way. But if I glue these down and you can ratchet all that down into place, those will end up being right about there. So this cable will be at a slight angle. I wonder if I could run another cable down to like here. Just put two of them right here. Let's try this again. Let's see what we get. Good constraint. I like that. So there you have it. It is functionally standing. Uh, if you want to see more about this, I have an entire second channel where I do a lot more of the how-to and I talk through what I'm doing, why I'm doing it, and that's where I put a lot of the information. So if you want to see more about what all is going on here, I'll go ahead and take a look at that. Also, I have a link to the playlist so you can actually see this whole thing step by step and uh, go through that. We're just get now getting to the point where this is almost done. Next time we'll be doing all the finishing touches and getting it all up and actually putting the turnbuckles into the bottom. This is the bottom and not the top. It'll be flipped over. Uh, there's a lot more 
more to do on this and it'll be kind of cool to see what happens when we actually can tighten them all down. And each one of the turnbuckles will allow me to adjust it one way or the other and, and provide a lot of integrity to this. So I'm really looking forward to doing that. On top of that, next time we'll actually be auctioning this off and I'm not sure what charity we'll be auctioning it off for. Um, if you have any ideas on that, let me know those down below. But I'm, I'm really getting excited about this and I'm looking forward to seeing where this all goes. It is kind of a, an interesting design and it's going to be a lot of fun to, to play with. This whole project has been a huge learning project to me. I'm really pushing myself in different directions and trying new things and I, I think that's one of the best ways to learn and to grow is to experiment, try new things and have a little bit of fun with it. So as you can see along this, a lot of the design on it has changed and a lot of it has stayed the same. Some of it is stuff that I know and some of it's stuff that's new. On top of that, I'm diving into the hive mind. It is a Facebook group called Wood by Right Hive Mind. It's where I bounce a lot of ideas off the audience and say, hey, I'm looking at this and I would put up a bunch of different designs for cable um, construction on there and, and thoughts to do that. So if you want to help out with that and join the hive mind, just go online and search for that and uh, ask to be joined into that. And uh, you can help out in designing some of this in the future as well as see some of the behind the scenes stuff. Speaking of behind the scenes, I do want to say a huge thank you to the patrons on Patreon. I do put up regular videos on Patreon of what's happening in the shop and what all is going on with that. So if you want to see any of that, go ahead and click on Patreon. There's links to it down below. Or if you click the join button on either of the channels, I do also put up the content on there as well. It's just one more way I can say thank you to the patrons on Patreon because without patrons, without members, this channel wouldn't exist. And so thank you for that, keeping the lights on and keeping us going. That means more than I can say to me and my wife. So thank you for that. And on that note, I think it's about it for now. And until next time, have a wonderful day. It is very good to keep your woodwork in the same manner that you keep your life. In balance.